Hi, welcome back to my show. I'm Craig and this is Mariana and today we'll be doing part two of Glow in the Dark Side. We are going to be doing Glow in the Dark Erupt Art. It would need vinegar, lit warm water, baking soda, a stick, a bag, and glow in the dark paint. These three already come with the kit and the baking soda. But these don't. These don't. Thank you. These are not, the vinegar and the water are not included. Okay, so what you'll need to do is put the paint in the bag. You have to put the whole thing. Easier. Ew, it's not like flowers. Huh? Can I try? Yeah. <laughs> so funny. Make sure all the paint is in the bag. Once all the paint is in the bag, you will have to start, you have to pour these two liquids together. So put this one in here. Right here? Mm-hmm. Okay, you're gonna make it. Okay, I think that's good. So now you have to pour the baking soda. This is three teaspoons of baking soda. The baking soda comes with the kit, but the little thing doesn't. So we're, we're gonna pour the baking soda in first. Okay, now slowly put the water in. We're going to wait for the room to get dark. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Now you can see it's, 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 it's bubbling it's slowly, slowly, slowly. Look at all those bubbles. See if it's just on its own. See the bubbles getting bigger and bigger. I really like this experiment, guys, because it was a really cool eruption and it wasn't very messy. Other thing I liked about it is how the two chemicals mix to create the one. What do you think, Craig? Same. And easy. To do at home with your dad, mom, and dad, or friends or cousins. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.